Hey everyone, this is Mr. Hammer. I'd like to welcome you to the channel. Please hit the like and subscribe button so you're notified of future videos when I put them out. <coughs> Alright, so today is a sad day for the city of Minneapolis. Um, one of our officers on the east side was responding to a domestic violence call. Um, those are the most dangerous for police officers to respond to. Anyways, and um, this officer, uh, you know, they approached with two other officers for the call and the suspect apparently when they knocked on the door the suspect opened fire um mortally wounding the officer um you know this just makes me as a citizen very angry um to see this happen um because the officer you know she's just doing a job and have some some piece of crap you know person decide to take her life it's not right it makes me angry um you know she's you know i mean yes the guys the person's in custody um i don't think there's ever any true amount of justice that can be done that can bring that officer back and i'm sure i'm gonna get some flap i'm about to say but i don't agree with i i mean i, I don't i feel sure far that the person that should if you shoot a police officer you should get the death penalty if this person did it in texas It'd be capital punishment, no questions asked. And yeah, Indiana, it's not so clear. Um, and I hope that you know that the prosecutor <clears throat> does the right thing and says, "Hey, we're going to seek the death penalty in this case." And you know, let's take a step forward. Let's take away their constitutional rights because the minute they shot that police officer, she died. She lost her right to live. She lost her right to be with her family. She lost all her rights. Why not take this piece of crap's rights away too? An eye for an eye, if you ask me. Um, some people say, oh, Mr. Hammer, you're wrong. You know, they have the right to live. Why do they have the right to live? Now, getting back to IAPD here, um, you know, they do a great job at what they do. Um, they're great police officers. <coughs> and, you know, um, they're out every day protecting us. You know, um, when we make a mistake, they call us out about it, you know? Um... You know, and the, the officers, you know, they have a very hard job. Um, you know, I'm not saying that every police department's perfect, but I'm very happy with um, the level of service that, you know, that they provide the community. Um, and, you know, especially during this COVID situation, you know, they've got more pressure on them. Um, to IAPD, please know they have my sympathies. Uh, my heart goes out to you guys. Um, I'm going to try to find out how I can send you guys a sympathy card for the officer's family. Um, and just know that today's a very sad day. Um, your department will be my prayers. I ask everybody else who's watching this video um, to please pray for the IAPD's off uh, the department and the officer's family um, that's going through a terrible time. Right on the holidays, it's just not on... Um, you know, not right, um, but what they're going through, and, you know, that's, so, so if we do anything, um, and yes, guys, we have a Nissan Pathfinder, who's driving like a maniac, um, but that's what, you know, that's because there's no cops out there, uh, to some extent, all right, so, getting back on, on point here, um, you know, they have a hard, hard enough job, and we need to support them, and let IAP, you know, that we, we care about them. If you see an IP officer and you can approach them safely, you know, please tell them hey, you're sorry for their loss. Um, and the IAP know that while you grieve, I grieve. We as a community all grieve. Um, anybody who's watching this video, please share it to any, you know, please show it to any IAP officer you may run into, into contact with and let them know. Um, again, IAPD, I'm so sorry for your loss. Um, just know, know your, you guys are my prayers. Thank you guys for the hard work you do. Um, all right, and what do we got here? We got some, we got some, oh my God, really? some kids trying to cross the fence or something. Interesting. They're not supposed to be on the highway like that. Mm -hmm. You know what you're going to counter while doing a video. Um, you see, and I'm sure these officers, um, they encounter you know they, they encounter a lot of stuff they probably see more stuff than most of us see um 
So, again, thank you, IMPD, for the hard work you guys do. I truly appreciate you guys. I love you guys very much. Um, thank you. God bless. Be safe out there. Bye-bye.